One month ago, I went to my first NFL game outside of America, the New York Jets versus the Minnesota Vikings. It was at that game where I truly realized how unique American football is in Europe. It was the stories of how they fell in love with the game that made it special. I just watched the Super Bowl. It was so crazy. And the day after that, I bought a Madden. What Super Bowl and Madden did you get? The Patriots and Seahawks uh, Super Bowl at the time. Play clock at five. Pass is intercepted at the goal line by Malcolm Butler. And it was Madden 15, the one with Richard Sherman on it. I had so much fun that I knew I needed a return trip. This is Mountain Day Shonen Stadt. München, Deutschland. Can I see y'all's jerseys? Oh. <laughs> Mitch is doing an interview over the NFL to I, I speak English. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Today's video is sponsored by Green Gridiron. It's the thick of football season. What other product would be better than an NFL licensed helmet in your living room? The helmets are completely wearable, so you can emulate prime 2012 Joe Flacco in your backyard. Or if you just want a cool backdrop to your Zoom meetings, the Speed Mini helmet is just for you. Use code IO10 to get money off your purchase today. The game tomorrow will be held at Allianz Arena, home of the well-renowned football club, FC Bayern. I'm very excited to see how they transform a football stadium into a football stadium. And the NFL has done it before, holding their first game in 2022. He's gonna throw it to Brady. Oh, and Brady slips and is picked up by Tariq Warren. With over 70,000 fans in attendance, the atmosphere was insane. Yes, this is experience. Which is exactly what I'm looking to capture today. the Bavarian cuisine, the music entertainment, the fans, and much more. But enough talk, let's get to the stadium. As you can see, beautiful stadium in the background. It really feels like a real futuristic stadium. I can't wait to get inside though, it's gonna be insane. I got this book right here. It looks like it was made in like 1847, but it's my German book. We gotta ask some of these German fans how they became a fan of the game. It's Deutsch Deutsch manchmal, so should be good. Wie ist es in Deutschland for the NFL? Also super, dass es geklappt hat, dass wir die NFL nach Deutschland holen konnten und alles. Das ist einfach ein riesen Spektakel und die Fans in Deutschland freut es natürlich mega. Und du? Unbeschreiblich. Wirst du das Deutschland als eine Mannschaft hat? Ja, das wäre geil. Eine deutsche NFL-Mannschaft wäre geil. The Seahawks? Yes, zum Beispiel. <lacht> Chiefs. Chiefs! Patrick Mahomes! Yes, yes. Wie hast du angefangen, Football zu gucken? Äh, mit acht Jahren. Habe ich mein erstes Fußballspiel im Fernsehen gesehen. Damals war das noch, glaube ich, Premiere hieß das. Dann seitdem äh, gucke ich Fußball und interessiere mich für Fußball. Ich habe vor fünf oder sechs Jahren angefangen, weil mein Bruder selbst gespielt hat. Er ist dein Bruder? Das ist mein Bruder. Ja, ja ich habe angefangen zu schauen mit ja, vor 20 Jahren und dann habe ich selber gespielt bis vor zehn Jahren. <lacht> Welcher Spieler hat diesen Zoom Amerikanischen Fußball gebracht? Es war eigentlich Marshawn Lynch. Oh. Ja. Beast mode. Yeah, beast mode. Yeah, yeah. So, what brought you guys out here to Germany? Uh, we decided just to go to an away game, and this is a perfect, nice vacation to enjoy ourselves, and hopefully the Panthers will win. And you guys live in Charlotte, right? We, we live just north of Charlotte in the mountains. I'm here in accent. Are you from America? Or? No, I'm from England. England, okay, yeah. How are you guys liking the experience of the NFL in Germany? No, I love it. We went to the London game a few years ago. We love that experience why we wanted to come here. Which one is better so far, the Germany one or the London one? I am one? not saying anything. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to start a war. Oh yeah, we definitely don't want to start a war here. How do you feel it so far? I know as a European, you kind of know about like the football the experience, but how do you how do you like it? I love it. I mean, I think it's great having it here. And like Lisa said, the amount of people is amazing coming to the game. So it'll be good. Wie ist es in Deutschland für die NFL? Sehr begeisterte NFL. Fans. Und du guckst immer die Red Zone. Ja, ich gucke immer die Red Zone. Wirst du das Deutschland als eine Mannschaft hat? Ja, äh, das wäre mega. Oder London wenigstens. Entweder London oder Deutschland eine Mannschaft. Wir haben Düsseldorf Rheinfire. Ja, aber das ist ja nicht NFL. <lacht> Wird du Spieler at this Zoom American Nissan Football Zebras? Also ich habe angefangen Football zu verfolgen, indem ich College Football UCLA geguckt habe. Ich habe ein Auslandsjahr in UCLA gemacht und habe dann im Rose Bowl immer äh, UCLA geguckt. Ja, ich mit Rheinfire angefangen in Düsseldorf. Es ist keine NFL-Mannschaft, aber europäischer Fußball oder deutscher Football. Yes. Mein Bruder. <lacht> mein Bruder, mein Bruder. Äh, Mahomes. Oh, Mahomes. Ah. Okay. Fantastische äh, Experience. Die deutschen Fans sind, glaube ich, auch mittlerweile super investiert in die NFL und äh, 
haben alle einen Riesenspaß auch. Deswegen glaube ich, würde auch die Stimmung in, Allianz, äh, in der Allianz Arena heute richtig gut sein. Ja, es ist eine Riesenparty, super Sport, macht mega Spaß. Ja, cool. <lacht> sehr, sehr cool, sehr cool. Let's go, keep pounding, keep pounding. I hear a little accent. Are you from America? Yes, sir, from Los Angeles. From Los Angeles, okay. But a Giants fan? Giants fan. We didn't have a team in LA. At the time I was watching football and then I saw the Giants play. Jeremy Shockey, Tiki Barber, became a fan. What brought you out here? I live in Italy, so I thought I'd come out and uh, check them out. Okay, so you live in Italy and you came all the way here for Germany. Yes, sir, I'm in the US Air Force, so stationed out there. So I can hear the accent. You guys are American, so how do you guys find how did you guys get here? Um, I'm stationed in Kaiserslautern, so that's about five hours away. So we ended up seeing this online and we was like, well, why not come to a first NFL game here in Munich, Germany? We just interviewed another Air Force uh, person that's stationed in Italy. So he oh, came wow. in, over here for that. Oh. Yeah. Are you much of a football fan or you just... No, no I just got no, it here. No, that's <laughs> so sorry. Look, I'm wearing, uh, what is this, a Casey? Uh, <laughs> Uniform. We just here just because it's just an American experience. We don't know nothing about football. Actually, what was it? Otis Anderson is in my hotel and it's full of New York Giant fans. And I walk out with this uniform on and everybody's like, what's going on? <laughs> I only know touchdown and first, what is it? First down. Do you guys speak German or no? Nine. <laughs> Nine. That's all you need to know. Wie ist es in Deutschland? Für die NFL. Es findet immer mehr Anklang, würde ich sagen. Also es ist seit, ich würde sagen, knapp zehn Jahren immer mehr im Kommen. Und äh, ja, wie man sieht, der Hype ist real. Wirst du, dass Deutschland aus einer Mannschaft hat? Nein, Deutschland sollte keine Mannschaft in der NFL haben, weil eine, die NFL ist, die, die ist eine amerikanische Sportart und die sollte auch äh, dementsprechend auch so weitergeführt werden. Wie hast du angefangen, Football zu gucken? Ich habe zufällig äh, mit einem Kumpel haben wir damals das, äh, den Super Bowl Giants gegen Patriots angeschaut und das war cool und seitdem, seitdem sind wir dabei. In uh, 2011 oder 2007? 11. 11. Ja. Welche Spieler hat die Zoom American Nissan Football Zebras? Mich tatsächlich die Seahawks, wie man sieht, äh, mit Marshawn Lynch damals, war, das war so der Game Changer für mich, wo ich gesagt habe, das mache ich mit. Ich habe auch ein Marshall Lynch Trick und auch das ganz alte zu Hause im Rahmen schön, schön verpackt. I can hear the accent. You're obviously from America. Yes. And then we're talking earlier. You said you're from Baltimore or from Maryland. Yeah, from Maryland originally. Yeah, down in uh, Atlanta, Georgia now though. What brought you here? Came in for the game all the way from Georgia. Yeah, flew in just for the weekend. So got here yesterday, leaving on Tuesday just for the game. What do you like about this German experience so far in the NFL? You know what? I've been very surprised. And to your hat's point, um, I've been very surprised by how many teams have been supported throughout the weekend. And the fact that every team had a home bar in Munich, that was really, really cool. So I've been really enjoying just seeing all the teams being supported and most of the people I've talked to so far have been German or European. I haven't even met that many Americans so far, which has been really cool to see all the Europeans supporting the NFL. Uh, hope you guys, hope your team wins today. Thank you. And <laughs> if they don't win today, you always have room in Ravens Flock. So. Yes, hey, I've got neighbors on my fantasy football team, so I'm just rooting for neighbors to do well and have a few, uh, have a few catches today, so I'm excited for that. <laughs> it seems like most people are American here. Interesting. Every time I try to speak German, they're like, oh no, I only speak English. Great for me though. So that wraps up the interviews. It was really, really good hearing all the experiences from the German fans and the American fans. Man, this game is really growing. But enough talk, we gotta get to the game now. <laughs> Can I see y'all's jersey? Oh. <laughs> it's like a steering wheel, crazy. Äh, man konnte sich halt bewerben und ich habe halt dann geschrieben, wie ich zum Football gekommen bin, dass ich, wie ich angefangen habe, Football zu gucken. Also ich hatte halt damals, ich lag im Krankenhaus, hatte nichts zu tun, habe da einfach angefangen, Football zu gucken. Das hat mich halt gecatcht und war halt dann für mich so, okay, da habe ich immer mehr geguckt, immer mehr geguckt, habe selber auch angefangen zu spielen, weil der Sport einfach, einfach geil ist.
the overtime thriller in Germany. Love every single moment of it. I love it, man. I met some good fans over here. Man, let's go, man. Let's go. Uh, love the atmosphere. As you can see, it's crazy, man. Also, let me know what I should do with this pretzel. I don't know if I should eat it or frame it or put gas up on it. But yeah, if you want more videos like this, make sure you subscribe. Yeah.